Fight fans, fight fans, fight fans. This is Kurt DeVille with Counterpunch Boxing News. And I have a counterpunch concerning Deontay Wilder and Andy Ruiz, okay? Now, I've been watching and listening to the comments that a lot of people have said, oh man, stop being biased towards Andy Ruiz. And I'm simply not. I'm just stating the facts, okay? And the facts are <clears throat> the same thing that Andy is wanting from Deontay Wilder, okay, is the same thing that Deontay Wilder wanted from Anthony Joshua. He wanted a split, he wanted a split deal. He didn't want a flat rate. Even though Deontay received from his offer a lot much than Andy, okay? Andy, three or five, three to five or something, four or five million, you know, was said to be around the dollar figure, but Honestly, that wasn't the case, okay, for um, Andy. Andy wanted like a 50-50 deal, you know, or his dad or whoever. They both wanted it, bro. <laughs> what his dad wants, he wants. His, his dad is just representing him, okay? So uh, I don't see how that's any different from when Wilder in 2018 wanted much more than he was worth because this is the issue. These fighters are not worth what they say they wanted based on a lot of things, based on marquee value, based on uh, ticket sales, based on previous uh, fight purses. Wilder, we broke, I, I did the video earlier, you know, 1.4, 1 1.2, 1 uh, 900,000, and another 1.4. Now, these were all fight purses before Deontay Wilder and Anthony Joshua started negotiating. Anthony Joshua and his team offered him 12.5. 12.5 million for someone that got 1.4, 1.2, 900,000, and 1.4 again. That's way more than enough. In fact, that's exactly the amount of money that Andy Ruiz or Malik Scott was complaining that these fighters are asking for when they are accustomed to making what Deontay Wilder made. Okay, so if anything, okay, to go further, Wilder and Team Joshua, Joshua gave them way more than they were worth. So people talk about the split all day long. Deontay Wilder was not only worth a split, he wasn't worth a split, but he wasn't worth the 12.5 that they offered him based on what he's accustomed to, okay? According to Malik Scott and his own ideology of what fighters make versus what they ask for. Because what they ask for, it's like ripping off Team Wilder, like they said, because they're asking for too much money. So if they're asking for too much money, that's their way of saying they don't want the fight. So if that's the case, by his own logic, well, that means Wilder did not want the fight in 2018. Counterpunch.